So just finished up with a day of work at the shop here, doing some video editing. Held I was working on some projects in the shop. I actually found out that the Percy Ed Meteor Shower was going on this week. Figured we'd uh, load some stuff up into the vans. Head for the hills, go find some low light. See what we can figure out for some meteor showers. And uh, looks like Eldad's sharpening his axe or something. Getting ready for the sticks. What's the plan? So what's up, what are we doing? You gotta always ask that stupid question. Well, the plan is to get the stamps. <laughs> Don't talk to me right now. I'm working with sharp objects. <laughs> Well, there it is. You've got the official word from Eldad, the latest and greatest about uh, where we're at, what we're doing. I'll tell you what, man, that's always the challenge with Eldad, is to try to get him to talk in front of the camera. The guy's always got something to say when there's nothing to be said. But as soon as there's something to be said, you can't even get him to talk. Boop. <laughs> He's over there bound and determined to get his uh, stick tamer, I guess is whatever he calls it, a little hatchet. So anyways, yeah, that's the plan. We're going to jump in the vans, head for the hills. That's the thing. You don't always have to wait for the weekend to get out there and do it. Just go out there and do it. Vanigan style. Go out there and do it. <laughs> There's a freaking echo in the room or something. So anyways, we're in the vans. Locked up the shop, headed to his house, grab a quick few things. Grab carry, grab some food, head for the hills, catch some meteors tonight. I really gotta be careful and watch what I'm doing when I'm filming and driving. Meow. Give us some insight, what's it gonna take to pack tonight? What, what, all, what all goes into it? Dogs, crate, underwear, at least one sock. That's all you're packing? Just a chair? <laughs> yeah. I'm stop back. <laughs> What's next on the list? <laughs> Are you ready, Lolo? A little short for that. It's a dog named Angus. So this is Angus, like the cow. We didn't give him the name. He came with the dog. So camping, right? You know, when you have dogs. I really don't know what to say about it. You just like chuck them in the back, drive out to the boonies, and guess what? They do their thing, you do your thing, and uh, hopefully you both survive. Why are you in my face? So what all did you pack? Toothpick, dogs, gun, wife. So my favorite thing to do for uh, food on a situation like this, it's totally last minute. I didn't even throw the barbecue in, but I always keep one of those uh, burners that fit right on top of the like the lantern propane bottle. I'm gonna throw the uh, like eight inch skillet right on top of that. I'm just gonna roast up some zucchinis, some mushrooms, some onions, maybe some green peppers, season it a little bit, throw some uh, sesame oil in it. It's perfect for the last minute adventures just like this.
a roadside emergency. <laughs> what happened? Carrie, what'd you do? I was too strong for the window. I have that thing super glued good and tight on there. <laughs> I don't know. What's up with your van, dude? I don't know. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> Carrie, are you crying or are you laughing? I don't know. <laughs> or are you crying? <laughs> I think we caught that like bump, that bonk on film. No, I'm okay. <laughs> We cut up some red peppers over here, some yellow peppers. We got some yellow zucchini, some green zucchini. We're gonna fry it up. Well, now we sit and wait. Food's cooking. Hopefully this uh, meteor shower's brewing up up here at the top of Mount Baker. There it is. Chicken, onions, mushroom, squash, peppers, and seasoning. Ready to eat. So we're not really sure what to expect with this uh, meteor shower. Clouds have rolled in a little bit off to the east. I don't know. We'll see. We're gonna figure out ways to entertain ourselves until uh, one or two in the morning when the uh, show is supposed to happen. Definitely an awesome way to wake up in the morning. Looks like the uh, lightning that we were experiencing last night might have started some fires out in the hills. Pretty smoky. Actually makes for a pretty cool sunrise though. Well, I was up to about 2.30 last night. Dang it, door's locked. Anyways, uh, yeah, about 2.30 last night, checking out the Perseid meteor shower. Uh, didn't see anything like super consistent as far as uh, meteors, but uh, definitely saw some really cool stuff uh, as far as falling stars and shooting stars or whatever. Basically a meteor shower. Okay, take two or three. God. Okay, take four. Yeah. Woke up to some van troubles with LDOT's van this morning, so finally got that going. Now they're headed down, so cool stuff.
making the uh, trek back down the mountain here. I think I might have got some really good Milky Way shots with the vans, so that's always good for Instagram. If any of you guys are on Instagram, you should uh, check out the uh, the Living the Van Life feed, which is at Living the Van Life, all one word. Should be pretty easy for you guys to remember, considering the uh, YouTube channel. So anyways, uh, making the 42-mile uh, trek back down to Bellingham. But in the meantime, I'm just going to enjoy this uh, beautiful drive down from Mount Baker. Lots of cool views from here.